We edit our children's <laughs> genomes. Steve, do you know what a genome is? <laughs> Something in the DNA, right? That makes up the who kind of we thing are, what we you, are. Who what you are. and who you are. Right. I, your I, genes. I heard that on yeah. the internet or something. Your genomes. Jade. You're a nurse practitioner. Yeah. And and I don't have a lot of experience with jeans and, and, and all of that kind of stuff. But You're I You're wearing jeans. Well, that's true, but these are a different kind of gene. G E N E S genes. Yeah. Spelled differently. G E N E S, right? Well, not these genes. Yeah, not J E A N. So anyways. Um, like I said, I don't have a big background in that, but I have a feeling the reason anybody would be thinking about that would have to do with diseases and conditions that they're trying to avoid um, in their children. What if I just want to make my kids better? Like I want him to run faster, hit the ball farther. I want him to hit harder. Like I want to, I want to, I want a super robo child. I no, I I personally overall don't think it's a good idea. I think when we start trying to do something like that, the human being is going to do whatever it wants to do in the end, and it's going to come back around to, to smack us in the bottom. Don't you remember when Skynet went live and became self-aware, and suddenly the Terminators took over? Mm-hmm. That, yeah, do you remember what the date was? It was August, mm, August twenty third. I could be wrong on that. I don't know when Skynet became self-aware, uh, but. Like, we could have super kids. We could just start altering them. You remember when Jeff Goldblum became a fly? Yes. In that movie, The Fly? Yes, it was gross. And, and he said, I feel great. I feel like it was uh-huh. strong. And mm-hmm. then he puked on stuff and ate it. Yes. And it was acid. And, ugh, that was fantastic. Like, I'd be so proud of my kid at that point. I was going to say, if, you, if we <laughs> could do it, why not? Well, because like I said, so, something is, is going to be off. I... I well, no, you know, you're going to go in there and fix everything and make the perfect human being. All right, so if we could alter your genomes, Steve, what would we alter about you? <laughs> <laughs> Everybody else's head yes. looks Listen. south as well. Yes. Steve, Steve, right. thank God. If you're listening to this podcast. I would want a little smaller feet. I was looking. I was like, <laughs> I wear a size 13. I was like, I'd settle for about a 10 and a half or 11. Okay. That that's so, where you're I mean, gonna go. I mean, well, you can if you could alter everything, you could go in and make the whatever you know. I, I guess everybody's would be different still though, because what you would think as a parent, you think these are all the qualities that you should have or should not have. You're gonna go fix all that, so you still be different. No, like well, my like when my boys when they when they walk down the beach, you know, there'd be two bare footprints, and then there'd be like this this dragon mark right between their legs where they were walking down the beach. <laughs> Shorten that up a little bit. <laughs> just be, it'd be like they're dragging a rake between their legs.